What's up, everyone? Matt and Justin here. We're playing Wizard of Legend. Yeah. It's a fucking pretty dope game. Oh, oh okay. One oh, time. I'm okay. on the right side now. Okay. I'm blue. Wait, wait. Time out. Let me get. Let me turn. Let me get to my spells. Cause I want to use some good shit. Get Can do ice. Fucking, yeah. I'll go. Show, I'll, for, I'll showcase some ice stuff. All right. Cool. So Let's... Wizard of Legend is a sick game. It's a roguelite. Uh, let's get to my interest. Cool roguelite where items. we do have offense and miscellaneous. So we can grab that. We can. I don't grab think we have. This. Oh, we do. Yeah. So you see, increase damage one. and movement when you're the true friend. So do you want that or should I? You can take it. All right. I shall then, brother. I'm gonna take. The, yeah. Wizard of Legend. I sick roguelite game where you go through a dungeon, you get some spells, you get to choose your starting kit, and then you can uh, pretty good, much just go from there. there. And it's super exciting. Uh, it came out very recently, actually, and we're just gonna have some fun with it. Never played it. It's yeah, gonna be good. I've been playing it on PS4 for a bit because I'm a ghoul, and Justin has not, so we'll see what goes down. He's probably still gonna be fine at it. Hopefully. Let's go fucking this way. Yeah, these kinds of rooms. Get the heck out. Those are the kinds of rooms where you want to just knock people directly off and then stun lock this guy. Oh. Oh, so it closes the door when you go into yeah. it? Okay. Get out here. <laughs> and that's <laughs> all you gotta do days. to beat the game. Okay. So I don't know what the um, difficulty up with co op is. I think it's that they increase the um, HP and damage, the HP of enemies. Alright, All right. Wow. so um, first impressions about the Ooh. game. Oh yeah, this is like a curse point. These relics come so, at a certain price. Don't let your greed for power become your downfall, alright. Yeah, so... so do we get any descriptions of these? I'm gonna get the Paranomazicon because I'm pretty sure your attacks on council members are more punishing. Enemy attacks pack an extra punch. Oh, fuck. Okay, I realize now. I thought it made the council members make puns. Fuck, dude. <laughs> oh, my God. I thought it made the council members make puns when you initially fight them, mm -hmm. but I just remembered that they always make puns when you go into a fight with them. Oh, the, I fucking hate these types of rooms. That's not too bad. It's just, it's spooky. So these guys will, like, block some physical attacks. They're weak babies. And then they, now they're dead. So now we can get some fucking spells. Each spell has an enhanced form, and that's basically like a little Agonims mm -hmm. Scepter upgrade for your spell. It does a bit more, maybe it's a bit of extra damage, maybe it's not. So Matt, that makes sense for me, but not Ag for the- is, Oh, sorry, Dota, Agonim Scepter is an item in Dota 2, where it will upgrade attributes of a certain ability or spell. Usually your ultimate ability or spell. But we don't have ultimate abilities, we just have signature abilities. Signature is just about the same. Yeah. Fucking Dragon Arc is a cool goddamn spell. It looks it's, so. It's satisfying to throw out. That's probably like one of my favorite things about it. In fact, a lot of the spells in this game are just satisfying to throw out. That's something I noticed. Oh, oh god. I missed that completely. Alright. I feel like I've been lied to. You told me I could stun lock people. You can, Not except the rogues. The rogues are like the one class of enemies that usually don't get stun locked that easily. Mm -hmm. So that's that's the middle. Oh, oh. The fucking heck fire him to death. Yeah. Go this way. Oh shit! It's a room of. I was gonna say something bad. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's a good thing you didn't. It's true. I've been working on my vocabulary. Also, fucking, this, my signature ice spell, it's really good if I have a far distance to send enemies, but very bad if I have like nowhere to shoot them. Because mm -hmm. it goes as far as it can reach, or the max distance to the spell, and then all the way back to me. Uh -huh. And it drags enemies for the whole ride. So it does damage across the it whole It does way? five damage every space it moves, basically. Okay, that's pretty cool. So what what exactly is our objective on we like, got each a floor? Our objectives are to go and beat like the different council members. We gotta go this way. I know those. I'm assuming those are the arrows on the map. Yep. Uh, no, the arrows are actually 
our different like rooms and shit, like uh, different special rooms. Okay. So like the like the guy was selling us. Yep. Thief items. Exactly. And shit. Stuff like that. Selling us the devil deals. Yep. Oh, you can't dash across that. No. Uh, Spikes. So you can go that way. Yep. All right. Let's keep it moving. Uh, we have to go up this way now to check. The floors are also pretty large. There we go. That's how you deal with them. Okay. All right. New battle. I'm going, I'm going, I'm getting him in. <laughs> <laughs> See you later, buddy. Okay, this guy you can stomach. Guaranteed. Just punch him. Look at this. He's got hearts. <laughs> what a cutie. I also, again, re oh yeah, so that's a, that's a little bolster there. Uh, so, we can check for, actually, I might want to go do? to the shop do, and buy Do we know shit. what any of these do? These, uh, I know the, I don't know the mirror shield. I don't know Shiva's water bottle, but I think this one will up my frost damage. The analytical monocle. I'm gonna grab it. What does this do? Uh, check, check it out. LT. Okay, uh, increases crit chance. That's pretty good. Nice. All right, let's get moving. Now we just basically hit this and we fight the boy. Uh, okay, so it's a crash night, so just stay out of his way. It sounds like a plan to me. He's fucking slapping me. Yeah. Oh, he's stunned. So that's one thing that I really like is that you combo the bosses in like the meantime. Oh, you can push me. With like my attacks? Yeah. Like your fireball windboxed me. A bit that's pretty wall. cool. Ooh, cake. Let's grab what does that shit. What does it do? Oh shit, I got boots too. Uh, taking damage increases your max health. All right, nice. That sounds really valuable. All right, so let's go to the. So we now have shop we have to kill two more people on this floor? No, not on this floor. This floor's done. We, I just want to check out those secret areas. So we got this, and then we Wait, there was a, a chest in the corner. He... It's just his little box of shit. Oh, okay. So we That's have the enhanced ion spike. We don't have money for it anyway. Aqua basic. All right, let's get that. Got no cash. So yeah, that's the first floor, basically. Okay. And it shows you the spell damage that you've done over the course of the floor. Random shit. All right, nice. So yeah, I don't know how much harder this is supposed to be with two players, but... I that mean, didn't feel very difficult. No. Judging from the spell damage, it's about double. Oh, hey. It puts a little fucking crown on whoever's doing more, I guess. That's you cool. know, you dead weight. <laughs> yeah. No, don't worry, I'll. You don't worry. I'm gonna get you. Yeah. Oh, we gotta fight the ice boy first also. I forgot we were going through his little dungeon. All right. His ice dungeon of ice? Yeah. Ice. Icy ice dungeon. Oh. Get him. Stunlock him, Justin. I'm gonna stunlock him real good. Hell yeah. Alright, we get that shit, and that gives us outside movement crystals and the outside usage crystals. So one thing I'm, I'm, I think I'm not liking right now about this game mm -hmm. is I think the HUD's a little out of the way, considering it's all yeah. cooldown based. No, the cooldowns on it are very hard to keep track of. I think, I well, agree. it's not even that they're hard to keep track of, it's that they're just not in a convenient, convenient place. If you're paying attention to like the top of the screen, it's very hard to like to keep track of the the white numbers on I, there. I absolutely agree. I've had a lot of trouble doing that, especially with Dragon Arc. Yeah, especially because like it. Get right back oh, up. Do it. Dragon Arc. That's pretty dope. Yeah, these are some the combos in this end up getting pretty nasty. You can do some cool shit. And uh, you can hit an enemy to interrupt their charged attack. So if an enemy's just sitting there and they have like a red line, then they're, it, you know, shows mm -hmm. what they're gonna shoot out. You just give them a tap and they'll stop. All right, so we got Ice Spear. We got Air Burst Dash, which is, oh, the enhanced version. Um, we got so Skills is that just like... I don't know what the enhanced version of Air Burst Dash does, but that's our it. basic one. Yeah, so. Is it like Double Dash? Check it out. You can check it on your spells. Uh, so Enhanced Create Shockwave that buffets foes in your path. Uh, Okay. Pretty so cool. I'm assuming it just pushes them? Yeah, it's, it's going to push everyone out of the way behind you, okay. which is nice, because that's uh, an important feature. Does it also go a little further? I think so. Oh, what the hell is this? Are those, like, summoning things? Uh, yes. Why? I hit- Why? I- Oh my god, I hate Frost Fan so much. The cooldown on that spell is retardedly long. Don't worry about it. I was having quite the trouble there. That's a, like my main issue, 
is I always get into engagements and then I just lose track of my cooldown. Mm -hmm. And then I'm like sitting there just getting hit like three times. I'm just like, what the fuck is happening? Yeah. Uh, yeah, this That's one. understandable. That's just uh, an issue with getting used to the game, I guess. Mm -hmm. Because your spells kind of, you know, they're not always going to be as accessible to you, despite the setup of the game making it feel like you'll be able to use your spells whenever you want. You know, I was coming into this, I assumed that, like, I was really shocked that I have a melee move at mm. all. I'm actually really surprised we have melee. Yeah, it's, and it, you like, it changes it up. You get different um, spell-based melees. Some of them are longer range. <laughs> Some of them will have more knockback and shit, you know, stuff like that. Uh, I might buy a potion here. You know, grab it. Oh, that heals both of us. A Nerite shell? Let's so start with what this Resolute Zvalin. Chance to slow foes, okay. Nice. Let's get the heck out. Uh, yeah. I always, I like the fact that you can't just fall off. Like, that's, <laughs> it's super forgiving. Oh, God. Okay, so these guys just jump when they jump. See, that's almost something I don't like, though. Like, I feel like it's too forgiving yeah like i kind of i i've had trouble with this game so i i think that that might be forgiving but other oh this is in sale what for 100 fuck <laughs> i'm coming back for that after the boss so i think like i feel like this kind of game should be very unforgiving mm -hmm. just because of like the nature of this kind of game almost all right let's eat this guy's ass yeah, let's destroy the burst mage the worst boss. I'm so bad about the burst mage. It just it shoots out a lot of projectiles. The projectiles are hard to deal with in this game. Doesn't seem too bad. Well, your spells are easier to cool down than mine, so you can use yours to counter his spells more often. I didn't even know you could counter spells. <laughs> yeah. I was can... just dodging. It seems like a large ass hitbox on those. You just gotta you just gotta go far away and I see like you just kinda because they bounce off the wall, so what you have to do is is not like you gotta stand a little away from the Grab wall. Grab that shit! I have no idea what it does. Flat gauntlet it allows you to destroy enemy projectiles with melee. That's okay. fucking sick! That's I was really literally strong. just ex I. The game knows, dude. Is that what you were trying to do? That's what I was trying to say. No, rather it, there's you don't have many options for getting rid of enemy projectiles. Mm -hmm. I was talking to James about that as well, but you can just kind of fuck them up with your melee mm -hmm. attacks now. Okay, yeah, it's interesting. Alright, so, each of the bosses, they basically attack in patterns of three. So wait for them to throw out their three attacks, and then go in for combos and shit. Okay. But you can still throw some shit out, and whip completely. She spins, and then, okay, go around these. Oh my god. We ate her ass. Yeah, no. This, I don't know. Is this game? Does it feel balanced for? I don't. It's, for this? it's a lot harder on uh, solo. Yeah, like this feels really easy right now, but it might just be because. Oh, okay. So it's not an invincible dash. No, it's not. Okay, all right. So I can understand where some of the difficulty comes from because I was assuming it was going to be invincible. Nope. And like pushing myself into a corner. But it still is fast. <laughs> Eat her ass. All wow, right. That was really quick. Holy yeah, shit. we destroyed her. Certainly know how to stay cool. <laughs> yeah, they make a lot of puns. Oh, wait, shit. What? But. Oh. Oh, baby. Okay. So we got a duel at the end of each one? Oh, god damn it. <laughs> Come on, buddy. Oh, your relic makes you stronger. What are you talking about? You get more health as you uh, as you get hit. I only have 358, it's fine. Wow, that was a big hit. Oh. 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 oh, dude, your moves combo so well. That fucking combo is sick. You're right. Yeah, that was dope. And it, it leaves us at the same HP. Oh, grab that shit, dude. That's Blazing Lariat. Try using that. Oh, that's pretty dope. That's a dope goddamn spell. 
All right, so if we have to duel at the end of each one, that's awesome. Yeah, that's and actually... And then we just kind of... See, I always, I think that's always a super interesting thing to do in co-op. Wait, how much health did you give me, total? I, like, increased your health by, like, 40. That's awesome. Get out of here. Is this even... Is that no, an enemy? They, they shoot, yeah. It's like just a stage hazard. Oh, oh you can fall from flight. Yeah, okay. I forgot that that actually gives you some momentum. Oh, we don't want to be here. Okay. Oh, fucking hell. Oh, oh, okay, we're good. This game seems very forgiving right now to me. It's, I feel like it's much more unforgiving on solo. Because I, <laughs> again, I had a lot of trouble with it going through it first. But you're not wrong. I, I, we haven't had much trouble at all. So what do you think, what do you, what would you say is like something that's good about this game? Um, I think the comboing on it is very entertaining. Like trying to figure out what you what builds you want to go into each dungeon with is mm -hmm. super interesting. Also, he just ate my ass. Yeah, that was a big hit. Uh, I think that the game does well on actually not giving you too much health. Like mm -hmm. it doesn't. I don't think it seems that way right now. But again, on solo, I have had a lot of trouble with maintaining high HP early on. Uh, that sounds about right. We're we're both relatively low health. Yeah, I ended uh, like 50. I couldn't make it to first bosses for a very long time, and then when I could, I ended up making that like uh, making it to them with only like less than fifty percent. So, mm -hmm. it definitely takes time. Damn. <laughs> but I think there's a good deal of room for improvement in this game. <laughs> so like, I wouldn't exactly say it's the highest skill cap. But there's a lot of different combinations you can do. A lot of different things, like knowledge of the game helps. I do we know. want to fight this right now? Yeah, eat his ass. Hmm. So how many... Whoa, oh, I shit. got fucking cocked instantly. I didn't even know he targeted me. So how many different um, enemies are there? Not much. Enemy variety isn't too crazy right now. Can I revive you or something? It would be great. <laughs> I'm gonna dance. <laughs> I'm dancing! <laughs> Alright, dance for it, dance. <laughs> Hell yeah! This is a cool mechanic, I like dancing. Oh fuck, he was doing another charge. I'm sorry, I might have- No, no, I was looking at him. <laughs> I, I didn't think he'd charge twice. <laughs> I like the dancing. Okay. Yeah, I, I think this is a pretty interesting co-op experience. I'm having fun with it so far. Let's switch up my, uh... Do we have any others yet? You can like take it. the busted offense relic if you want. No, it's okay. Alright. I'll keep my stuff. I just want to see if we got it, like, unlocked anything. Uh, no. We got to go out and buy that stuff now. Oh, okay. So then you so buy we go out the to the plaza. Currency. Yep. Premium currency makes it sound like you have to pay for it. You don't have to pay. No, it. you don't. So you or we can buy, buy more like outfits. Phoenix All right. I'm going to pay. I'm going to fucking... Oh, that gives you a chance to burn on attacks. It's super good. Okay. So, yeah, that's interesting. I'll grab that. And burns are pretty strong. Because, like, any, any kind of dot in this game is pretty important, honestly. Mm -hmm. Ah, I like... Hmm. Do we want to buy an outfit? Cause it, I'd, I'd rather buy more... weapons personally. I feel yeah, like, I'm down with that. Let's I get a like, fucking whirling tornado. Yeah, I feel like like you need um, more weapons first. Like it's mm. probably the the quickest way to do like do well. Oh, that's a cool fucking attack. I'm gonna do. Huh? What am I gonna do this time? I'll just go with the flaming lariat as my extra. Hell yeah. Let's go. Let's get in there. 